Welcome back. I'm going to do the spiral hair rod and as you, as you can see, I already did three. This took me about an hour because I'm practicing what's the best technique and how to tie it. These are the spiral rods. The 35 in this plastic bag. And they're short. My hair is very long. See what's the best way to tie it at the, at the bottom. This little clips to put it at the end when you tie your hair. But also, I am going to use this hair tie because my hair is not staying at the end of the rod. And I'm also using the It's a 10 to minimize the freezing. Also, I'm using Camille Rose Butter. It's good for curls, coils, and transitioners it's helping to put the hair around the spiral rod so this is the way I'm doing it so you're going to twist the hair I still have this side and this side to do let's do a green one Okay, you're going to twist the end. You're going to clip your hair. But the technique here is to keep twisting the hair to wrap it around. This is taking a long time and it's hard not to get it right, but oh Ooh, I messed up, I messed up. Oh no. I'm grabbing my other hairs. Ooh. Okay. My hair is so frizzy. Okay, this is what I was talking about. See that it's not enough for the end of my hair. So I just kinda wrap it around. At the end of it of the rod I do use the little clip that they send you and just put it around it does stay but to secure it I just get a a hair tie and just tie it around at the end of it how can I even do that okay I will cut this at the end and that's it I'll be right back I just spent about more than three hours just doing one side of my hair and I am done I don't think I have any patience for more. It looks like they're falling off too. Uh, I just want to see the results. And I did use all my 35 on this side. I have any more to do on this side. And I don't want to spend three more hours on this side. I think it's too much. My neck is hurting just to look on this side. And my arm is hurting too. It's just this takes a lot of time a lot of time okay let's see the results in a couple minutes or maybe hours I'll be right back okay we are going to take this off and let's see it looks like some are already falling out and the reason I'm taking it off like in less than an hour is because I have to give my kids a bath and I know they're gonna throw water in my hair and all this is gonna go down so let's, let's get started on removing this 
we do this at the end. Let's start in the back. That's gonna be hard because I put a hair tie at the end. <laughs> it is hard to take them off. Oh no. Okay. <laughs> I put a hair tie at the end. Oh no. Big mistake if you put a hair tie at the end. It's hard to take it off. I don't want to get out. I want my hair. Oh. You know what? I actually love it. <laughs> and I still have one here. <laughs> no wonder I love it so much. It's It takes a lot of time. I spend more than three hours just doing half of the side, half of my hair. And I'm not going to spend another three hours doing on the other side and it, and it takes time also to take it off because I decided to put hair ties because there's not enough little clips and that takes a lot of time as well I just spent like half an hour taking this off and if, if you don't do it right oh my god all your hair is gonna get stuck on the spiral rod and it's gonna hurt but after all, with the little time that I left them on to curl, I think this is very nice. And my hair is so long. Leave a comment down below if you guys are willing to try this. I think it's worth it. But if you don't have patience, I don't know about that. <laughs> and my hair is still falling because I because I was getting tired, I was doing it, just wrapping it around and my hair got tangled. So this is what happens. I am done. Leave a comment down below. What do you guys think? Like it or not? If you like this video, thumbs up and please subscribe for more videos every week. Thanks for watching.